guys, welcome to Solo YouTube channel. This is Hedy, and today I will show you something very interesting, but not about the 3D printing. As you can see, this is our pen prod Solo S01, and today I will use it to prod some photos I got in my daily life. And one is my selfie, so I guess you will be interested. And the other photos are from the Solo user group. So how can I do that with, with this machine? If you are interested, let's get started. At first, we need to download Inkscape software. So go to Solo official website, solo3d.com and check the support. And there is Solo S01 document download. And I will download 16-4-bit and download. I recommend you download Inkscape software on our website. Then if you don't need to download another extensions because it is included on this software. So just install and then we also need to download another software. The name is Quick Draw that can transform the brightness of an image into the sound waves. And here are some descriptions. You can check it on our website. And this cat is so cute. Okay, we also this is the link. When you click the name, then you will go to this page. So just download the code. And we also need to download another software, the name is Processing, and just to download it. 16-4-bit. Uh, then we can open the files. And we also need to add another file, I will show you later. Just uh, click there and uh, add a file. The name is, you can search here, Control P5. Yeah, just install. Then run it. So now we can import the, load the picture. Those Elsa and Anna, I already ported them, so I will. I already prepared not not other future photos. My selfie dog and a kid that Gary shared in the user group and a loads. So I just uh, adjust these parameters randomly because I'm not so familiar with this and how to and know how to expand that those functions. But I will work on it. Now it's very light, um, much better now. Then make other try. Uh, I think it's it's clear now. So just to okay, I think it is good now. Then I will save the file. The Inkscape can recognize SVG file. So here is, and I will rename it in case I forgot the name. Then we can on this icon. I must to to see something about it. Will you click this icon? This. You can change the width and the height by the same proportion. So when you use Inkscape, you will you will need to know this icon because you it, the important step to is to adjust the size of the picture, right? And this preference is for and when you click this preference. 
you can just change the interface and the, the language. When I install Inkscape at first, the language is, is Chinese. And then make sure you can understand easily. I just set it in English. And then just uh, check the import. Then you can import the file that you want to plot. I will import my selfie at first. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. Um, because I really love it. And can't wait to see the final results. So drag it in the correct position. I would like to drag it in the center of the paper. And make it smaller. When you click the corner, you see that there are several but buttons on the paper. On the pictures, when you click the corner, then you can change the size and rotate it. So we can just uh, get to G code and uh, check the, our extensions. The name is Solo Workshop. Here it is and generate a G code from path. We need to copy the name of the folder. If you don't copy that, it won't save correctly. So copy there. And the path to. Then apply. Then you will get a G code. So here is and we, I will also re rename it. And one not here. Uh, you need to click this button so the lines can be connected and it will save your time. And then we can just uh, start to plot all the G code have been done. And first we need to level the paperboard so just uh, click pen control and uh, make it up then you can hold the pen and lever it is easy just uh, you can put the pen in the lowest position of the paper and make it lower and lower then make sure all the corners of the paper can be rotten. Okay, I think it is done. And just a pen control. And then you can alter home. Then the pen will be in the corner. And make sure the nib match the con the left button of the paper okay let's back to the menu and uh, select plot from tf and then select the selfie file and begin to plot so our first picture is beginning so this is my selfie and wow <laughs> it is amazing and the second so you can see that is a dog and with uh, loving jars, jars. And this rose, <laughs> so beautiful. And the loving kid that Gary shares in the shared in the group. So all the pictures are done. And which one do you like most? My selfie or the rose or the dog? Oh, this lovely kid. Oh, just a comment below and I look forward to know your opinion. And I think if you have 3 printer, you can print a frame and to put this 
paper and hang it on your room. I think it is very good deco. I think the pen pot is very easy to use, but about Inkscape, if you want to design something by yourself, it may be difficult. But if you just to import an image to Inkscape and you get the check, do you call it that it is very easy? I will keep on learning Inkscape and try to design something by myself. If you are interested, just subscribe to our channel and if you like this video, just hit like or share button. That will do us a favor because more people may see it. And at last, thanks for your watching and see you next time.